The perfect serve at the perfect time. South Florida comes back to force five. Andraj splits the scene with a sniper shot. Point South Florida. <laughs> DeWitt is stuffed. Another block for the Tigers. That is their fifth of this opening set. Free ball just over. Scrambling, Andraj tools the block. <laughs> From match point Memphis to match point South Florida. And the freshman has put this place on its feet. In the Florida heat, the only thing that burns hotter than the scorching road of Interstate 4 is the distaste between UCF and South Florida. It's the war on I-4, and you're watching the AAC on ESPN+. Plus. At the top of the AAC standings, UCF holding court, trying to keep pace with the Cougars of Houston. They need to win out if Houston keeps winning to maybe get a share of the AAC title. Alongside the former All-Conference libero, EJ Tanner Goker, I'm Ryan Urquhart. EJ, this is a very potent Knights offense. Some of the best you'll find in the country. How can the Bulls keep pace today? Absolutely. This is a Knights team that's ranked 24th in the nation. Right. Michaela Washington comes back into the front row. And she's got a roommate, CC Clawson, behind her as Johnson goes back to the service line. We mentioned Washington's knee injury that took her out for about 400 days of no volleyball. And she was in a straight leg brace for a good portion of that. And CC Clawson, her roommate, drove her and took care of her for everything. Doctor's appointments, practice, training, recovery, all of it is Memphis gets another block. But... Man, talk about a good roommate and a good teammate. Oh, yeah, talk about a teammate. You love to see that, and especially the relationships kind of between the defenders and the offense and having those middle libero relationships. I think it's very enduring uh, to kind of see that take place. I think CC Clossy might have a <laughs> argument for who does the dishes in perpetuity <laughs> as this makes it 21 to 16. <laughs> and back to Maria Clara Andrade out of Sao Paulo, Brazil. Leading the team in kills per set right now. Had 17 against Tulsa. That was her best marking conference play yet. Yeah, big number for a freshman to pull that off. Sneaks it down the sideline. It's a point for the Tigers. And boy, they have taken control down the stretch of this opening frame. Uh, they really have. And, and Tolkien kind of showed that tip early. Uh, so you want to, as a defender, kind of make that read and charge early to be able to run that ball down. Johnson will try Washington. And it goes across the way to get the point. Yeah, great kill by Washington. Uh, leaving her kind of in, inside the court a little bit. Full approach and goes cross court. One of the best kills I think we've seen so far in this match. Left side. And at the pin. Great shot by Tolki to get the point. This Memphis group has hit very well in the first set. And that kill actually puts them above 300. Svitkovic off the fingertips and sails into the green paint for a South Florida kill. Much needed point for South Florida. Uh, Memphis was a little late setting up that block. It goes off the hands of the right side and no one's able to run it down. Kelsey O'Loughlin, team's leader in service aces, steps up. Long set left side for Tolki. And a spiraling <laughs> shot falls to the attack line at set point Memphis. Yeah, smart play by Tolki. Uh, she went for a tip on the prior uh, point, and then she's going for a roll shot again. Uh, the Bulls have to adjust in defense to uh, determine who's going to run that ball down. That's what we call kind of the dead zone of the court. Uh, perhaps it's O'Loughlin that, that wants to kind of step in and get that. Dewitt, an absolute meteor at the left pin. Wow, that didn't seem like an underclassman kill to me. A great approach, a perfect set all the way out to the antenna. Lots of room down the line, and she hammers it down. Memphis trying to put it away. Right side, 
off of O'Loughlin for the kill. Jasmine Tate cleans up the first set, and the Tigers take it 25 to 19. Yeah, great performance by Memphis. They did really well from the middles and from the right side. Uh, two kills for Jasmine Tate and Nova Maya City Smith with five kills. Oh, Memphis oh, hitting 345 in the first. They'll look to take the second when we return to Tampa. News, USM exclusives, and everything.